how quiet it is when it's moving though, no sound. Uh, back to the roots of the channel, I feel like. Today's product is a brand new network camera. Special thanks to Yeewise who sent out this pan, tilt, and zoom camera. You can see there, it kind of looks like a security camera that you'd see on the side of like big building or maybe way up top to, you know, be able to see a lot of your property. So Yeewise reached out to me and wanted me to create an unboxing and setup video for you guys. So that's exactly what we're gonna do. We're gonna go through everything that comes inside the box, download their app, and then go through the entire setup process. So again, special thanks to Yeewise for the free product. Now in between the Johnny Depp trial, click like, click subscribe, indulge in your life at indulgeclothing.com for the merch. And let's check out this Yeewise pan, tilt, and zoom camera. All right, so here we are with the Yeewise PTZ Speed Dome Wi-Fi camera. This is a network HD camera. You can kind of see here exactly what the product uh, would look like. It's showing it's IP66 weatherproof. Uh, that's probably day and night, pan and tilt features. Not, in, not entirely certain what that means. That might mean like uh, for an SD card. So uh, here's some of the features on the side. So yeah, there is an SD card, infrared, mic, power over ethernet, speaker, Wi-Fi. Same kind of picture there. And a wired or wireless camera, support smartphone and computer. Oh wow, supports smartphone and computer. Wow, remote surveillance, the Yeewise PTF Wi-Fi camera. So uh, yeah, let's, let's open this on up, see what comes in here. Okay, nice. So a uh, installation manual, looks like everything you need with the app. Command codes. Those can be helpful. Look at that, they even included a little uh, ethernet cable with it. Got a wireless antenna. This seems to be a plug. Yeah, power adapter. Oh wow, whoa, this actually has some weight to it. And then our screws to mount it, as well as another piece. And, oh, I don't know what that's for, but it's for something. That's it for inside the box. Wow, so this thing, Seems very, very, very durable. Okay. So, wow. So this thing really feels industrial. Like this is a professional grade camera. Wow, this is very nice. So it looks like my wireless antenna would go in up here. It must be under this is the SD card, I would guess, maybe. As robust as it is, I would see them having it hidden somewhere like that. Like just the weight of this thing, it's, I'm very surprised at the weight. Not in a bad way, just it's very, very nice. Now our three cables here, um, I, let's see, I don't know exactly what this one does. That seems to be like a reset button of sorts. I'm um, not entirely certain on that just yet, but this is where your network cable would go in. So we're gonna have to figure out somewhere to maybe mount this thing and run this cable. I don't, uh, I don't fully know what I'm really gonna do with this, but we're gonna, we're gonna get it set up nonetheless with their app, try it out and uh, see exactly what kind of picture quality we get from this Yeewise PTZ dome camera. So uh, let me get this cleaned up and let's get my phone out and start the setup process. All right, so now we're gonna set up our Yeewise PTZ dome camera. I still just cannot get over the quality of this thing. It feels so robust. Let's, uh, let's first take these screws out real quick. I think this is where we'll find our micro SD card slot, maybe a reset button. Finally. All right, so yes, there is definitely a micro SD card slot right there. So uh, we're gonna leave that off for now and take our nice power cable here. Let's check out this cable length real quick. Very nice, about a 10 foot power cable, I'd say. So I'm gonna drop this down, get back. There we go. And then we'll take and plug into here. And then we'll just have to plug in the other side. All right, it is plugged in and it's on. <laughs> that was really quick. How quiet it is when it's moving though, no sound. And this thing has some weight to it. Like 
Man. All right. That must be its setup sound. So here is the Ease Cloud app. We're going to download it. Bingo. And install. And let's move some of this stuff. And we'll open the app. And it's wanting a phone number to log in. So we will uh, register. Here it's giving an email or phone number option. So it seems you can do either one. There we go. Now our account is set up. So we do have a little flashing light there, even though there's no ethernet. Screw on our little Wi-Fi antenna, which just literally screws on top. Just like so. And, and now I'll come into our app, click the plus sign, click the add smart device, give it permission. So we'll click the plus sign and it wants us to scan a QR code which ah, must be the one here. Bingo. Pictures for only reference. These are for the actual product. So it's found the item. We will click add. Actually hold this just in case. So it's telling me to hold the reset button if it doesn't uh, flash at me. It says some device light should be blinking. I don't see a device light. I'm going to say that it is blinking. And now it wants my Wi-Fi info. And now it's giving me a QR code to scan with the camera. Wireless settings, please wait. All right, so I click that bottom button and... The wireless connection is successful. Very nice microphone. So we're going to call this Yeewise. P T Z. We're gonna say it's in the study room, and I'm just gonna make a. I don't care about that password because I'll be resetting it later anyway. All right, so there's our camera. Oh, here's our look at all this lens control. What SD switched it to HD mode. Pan, tilt, and zoom. Oh yeah. Let it look. Down. There we go. Hello. <laughs> um, man, lots of options here. Let me uh, just kind of set this here for now. So there is an alarm. Screen lock, PTZ self-check, sound. Let's put in a uh, SD card. So that is an SD card, class 10. We're going to slide it right in the back here. There we go. Pretty easy to put in. And so now I should have a setting. So we're going to go into the settings of the, the camera. And so devices ID, type, version, the Wi-Fi, enable auto recording, can work with Alexa. Oh, here we go. Device storage, cloud storage, TF card, advanced settings, video screen flip, video quality settings, time settings. So we're going to restart the camera and see if our uh, memory card takes. There's our camera back. That switched it back to SD. That's pretty weird. And uh, if I full screen this, does it look any different? There you go. There's a bit of a picture. Let's see what's in settings now. So it's formatting the TF card. Now I'm telling it to format it. And now we should actually be able to use it. As you saw before, it just said uh, unknown. So. It's in the process of formatting, and uh, then we should be able to use it soon. But definitely a very nice camera, a very, a very good quality camera in terms of the material that it's built with. I question some of the uh, picture. looks really cl clear. I don't see a lot of lag there. All right, that took a screenshot. Pretty cool. All right, so we'll have to give this thing some more time to uh, initialize the card, and then we will uh, try the light out. Let's do, and what's the microphone sound like? What are you doing? 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 Very good, loud mic. Wow. That's, uh, that's something else. And you can see that is uh, what those LEDs look like on the very front of the Yeewise PTZ camera. And that should essentially do it for the Yeewise PTZ camera. All right, and so I think that will do it for this Yeewise Pan, Tilt, and Zoom outdoor security camera. Now, as I've mentioned a few times, the quality of this thing, it feels like it's made out of some metal aluminum. It feels rugged, like you could run over it with a truck and it would be perfectly fine. The uh, addition of the micro SD card on the bottom means that you never really have to pay for a cloud storage service because you can just use the micro SD card. 
and the daytime and nighttime picture quality seem just fine for an outdoor security camera, as well as the uh, speaker is quite amazing. So definitely a nice pan, tilt, and zoom camera from the folks over at Ewise to thumbs up from me. I'll of course have this exact Ewise camera linked down below in the description if you'd like to grab one of these for yourself. And I think that will do it for today's video. Click like, click subscribe, indulge in your life at indulgeclothing.com for the merch, and we'll see you in the next one. Deuces.